Hey guys, so I realized I did not do a proper intro to this video. I kind of just like jumped into it with me doing an unboxing and I came now to just do a proper intro and just to say welcome back to my channel and I really hope you enjoyed this vlog. There's going to be a lot of stuff happening so stay tuned for that and yeah i'll see you guys a little bit later um so we're just gonna jump right into this vlog i just got a package from boohoo it is about five days behind schedule so i was really worried that i wasn't gonna get it but i got it today i was reading a lot of comments in the boohoo instagram where they were saying basically that there was a lot of delays going on and even if people did get their package they were getting like wrong stuff so i'm a little bit scared but we are going to open the package now. I did spray down the bag and I let it sit for a little while before I, you know, touched it and brought it over here. So I am being safe, no worries about that. Um, let me actually try to get a thumbnail real quick. All right, I just got that thumbnail. Let's hope it's a cute one. So let's pop this bag open. The box is super crunched up. Like it's been through hell and back. Let's see if it's the right shoe. Oh, I just love shoes. So yeah, these are the shoes. They're just this white sandal. I don't have anything like this in my closet. So I think you guys can see that, right? See? So I wanted some clear low heeled shoes to wear with jeans to wear it to work. And this one was in the nude color. So I know with these like transparent shoes, the buckle here by the toes be like scrunching and squeezing and killing your toes. So this is the shoe. Super success, very happy with those. I kinda know what this one is, I'm pretty excited about it. Um, it should be this leopard print. Yes, so it's this, so you guys know like, just gonna tall as I put this on. I feel like I'm doing a lot of hauls, but most of this stuff was sent to me, so I'm not like sitting at home spending all my money. But this channel was basically kind of supposed to be a traveling channel, like the vlogs. I wasn't supposed to be doing so much like at home vlogs. That was not my intention. My intention was to do vlogs like when I travel because I did so much traveling before I even made this YouTube. I was going to like, you know, France, Paris, Bali, like I was just going everywhere and I never vlogged it. And so I finally was like, okay, let me just make a YouTube and vlog about those travels and also about Germany. As soon as I start vlogging, shutdown happens and all it looks like right now is that I shop and that I'm at, I'm just boring at home, but that's not me. Liter like literally, I wanted to show you guys like what I'm doing outside, but I love these and they fit perfectly. <laughs> um, this one I'm excited about because I also don't have any shoes in this type of color. So I basically purchased these other sandals in this rose gold color. Look at those shoes, guys. How cute is that? Ignore that I'm wearing these leggings, but how freaking cute is that? Also ignore any type of ash that you see. It's just a rough time for me, but look how cute these are. Hey guys, welcome back. So today is, what day is it? Why do I never know? So today is Thursday. Oh my god, today is Thursday and I have quite a few interesting stuff happening today, not really. Um, I want to do a little haul for you guys and I want to show you guys how to make this very easy at home two ingredient donut and if you saw my instagram i'll include like a little clip i just made it in 10 minutes these donuts and you do not need anything else except for two ingredients it's really really easy so i will include the little tiktok that i created i will put it here on the screen enjoy it for one second and i'll show you guys in detail how i did it This was not my recipe. I got it from a girl on YouTube. I will try to find that video again and link it below so that you guys can see the video and then I can give her credit. Now I just want to go over the little haul that I did and then we can go into making some donuts for today. So I decided to buy this. It was very affordable and it just seemed a lot easier to me than ironing. So 
So it's it's called a steamer. Um, I'll link it below. I'll try to find an equivalent also in the Amazon US store. Just like put your clothes up on a hanger and just steam through all of the wrinkles. And I thought this was just a lot easier for me than ironing because I'm lazy when it comes to ironing. What I am very excited about as well is that I bought this French press. I'm gonna show you guys. I rearranged my whole coffee corner. If you saw my apartment tour where the coffee machine was and the coffee pods, I have completely changed that scene. What I picked up was a kettle. If you saw one of my other videos, I was like, I don't own a kettle. I just boil everything from the pot. Now I don't have to be old school. I have a really big kettle, so I'm pretty happy about that. Um, then I bought this French press coffee. It was very affordable. I will try to link everything below. Then I bought this marble cutting board. It's like half marble, half wood, and I thought it fit my whole aesthetic perfectly, so that was great. French press is actually very easy to make. I will do another video tomorrow about how I made my French press. It tastes really good, and I make it in a way that it's very simple. Online, they just show you the most complicated things where you have to do the right measurements and this and this and this I just do it simply behind that I got this coffee grinder which is wireless which is why I love this one this was also just like $14.99 it was so cheap to make that coffee this morning I grinded up some coffee and this is what is left at the bottom and then just behind there, I just have the coffee beans and I just got that at my local supermarket. Okay, so let us get started into making the donuts. It should be really easy. So let's go through all the items that you will need. So here is the pot that I'm using to fry the donut. You're gonna need some plain yogurt. This is the yogurt that I'm using. You're gonna need some sugar. You're going to need flour or self-rising flour. If you have self-rising flour, that's all you need. But if you just have flour like me, you're gonna need flour and some baking powder. You're gonna need like a little Ziploc bag and you'll need some cinnamon, I forgot. This is what you're gonna need for the coating at the end. So I'm gonna be doing one cup of flour. these are not the most well-formed donuts i think the ones that i made two days ago were a little bit more circular but whatever it's still a donut this is the finished product right now try one i think you guys can also try it with chocolate like dipping it in some chocolate sauce that would be also really good hey guys good morning so today is now saturday i'm feeling a little bit drained i had a bit too much alcohol yesterday um and yeah, I am still recovering. So I woke up, had some lunch because it was basically lunchtime. I had some coffee. I think in the clip before this, you guys saw my new coffee machine, which is over there. It's not really a machine, it's a French press. And basically I tried it out and the coffee was great, but I made way too much coffee. So what I did was 
I saved the rest of the coffee, I put it in this jar and then I put it in my fridge and so I've been using it now for iced coffee, just put some ice in there, I have some oat milk, mix that together and that's basically what I was drinking this morning. Today is going to be a unpacking day. I have gotten a lot of new packages, home stuff that I wanna show you guys. One of them is coming from Amazon and it's still not here yet. It is kind of this net for my balcony door so that I can now leave my balcony door wide open without any bugs, mosquitoes, bees flying in. If you guys have been following me, you know that I have a serious bee issue on my balcony and I'm certain there's a nest somewhere, somewhere. On top of that, I also ordered from Ikea this cheap little garden um, balcony set. This is basically two chairs, two little chair pillows and the table. That should be coming next week, Friday. So that's going to be in a, another vlog. But the balcony is now being worked on and I feel super productive because the guest room is in process and now the balcony is basically finished. I'm not doing anything too crazy on the balcony. But yeah, so let's just go in the unboxing. I got a lot of packages today. Not a lot, just like two packages. Um, I think one is from AliExpress, but I don't know what it is. And then the other one is from this store called De Depot. Yeah, it's called Depot. Let's just open it, see if everything even came. I love live unboxings. This, oh, I love they put like a little catalog in here. This is so cute. So this is the catalog at the front. Look at that balcony set. Oh my God, I would so love that. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I, I'm just terrible. Like I don't measure and this is what I get for not measuring. So I wanted to get a new little cact, like a fake cactus for my plant pot holder over there. And I thought it was gonna be at least like this big. Look how big it is. This is just embarrassing. Where am I gonna put that? All right, so I have this very tiny cactus, fake cactus. Don't know what I'll do with it. I swear it was supposed to be bigger, but whatever. I'm really just a shit person with measuring, but that's fine. So I got this little vase here. It kind of has a gold rim. You can kind of see it. And I wanted to switch it out with the gold um, pot that I have here. And I bought a lot of pampas grass. And so I wanted to put that in here. I think it will still look cute. It is very small, but it will do. So I got this vase. I want to put this in my bedroom and I'm gonna put some white pampas grass in here. You guys will see everything when it's finished, but I'm super excited about this one. And the last one that I got, it's gonna be a floor vase for me. So I got this vase as well. It is kind of, what is that in there? I don't know, it kind of looks like snowflakes are inside, but I think it's just dirt. But anyways, I got this one to put on the ground where my mirror is right here, because right now I have this assortment on the ground, but that is more of a winter assortment and I want to switch it out now for like a summer type of vibe. So the next thing I got is from AliExpress. I actually don't know what it is. LOL, it's actually not from AliExpress. I'm doing another review on Julia. They sent me something else. I completely forgot about it. Okay, so this is gonna be another video in itself. I won't show you what it is, but definitely stay tuned for that review video. It should be coming soon. Mm -hmm. 